This past year has been a challenge for us all. The COVID-19 virus has impacted us greatly. COVID has just ravaged every part of life that we know it. We realized very early on that a lot of people were really struggling. We saw families that were a step away from being homeless. It was not limited to one town, one state, or one region. Everyone felt the effects of COVID. Gitabu Charities taught us at the time of crisis, communities should be able to come together and support each other, making sure that the most vulnerable are not left behind. Greater Good Charities responded to this disaster like we do in any disaster. We immediately became all hands on deck. When everything was shutting down and store shelves were empty, food was scarce, Greater Good was sending trucks all over the country. Working with our partners to bring them PPE, masks, things like hand sanitizer, bed sheets, towels, water filters to help reduce exposure so that they could respond as safely as possible to the situation at hand. We've expanded our services to meet the need while working diligently to safeguard our participants, tenants, staff, and volunteers. We started to brainstorm creative ways that we could continue meeting kids wherever they're at and caring for them and their families. There were many families who did not either have an internet facility. So as a result, the education of those children was greatly being hampered because of the pandemic. The remote learning center was established as a means of educational resources for the kids in our community. Tutoring services, school supplies, internet, as well as technology. To stay connected to their communities and most importantly, to stay connected to their education. We were even able to pass out COVID relief kits, STEM kits, physical activity kids, our kids. These great backpacks. Good packs with hygiene and care items. It allowed us to reach vulnerable populations with backpacks for homeless individuals. The veterans that we come in contact with. These resources are literally saving lives. And they were just extremely grateful. During COVID-19, we experienced a 40% increase in the need for food assistance. Folks that had never anticipated having issues feeding their families found themselves for the first time waiting in line in a food pantry. Which is why I'm launching Feed Thy Neighbor with my friends at the Hunger Site, Greater Good Charities, to raise funds to help the very neediest among us. In an effort to serve as many people as possible, we have collaborated with our partners to provide drive through distributions and walk-in pantries. We distributed over 15 million pounds of food. At our height, we were doing 16,000 meals a day. We served over 10,000 meals. Over 21,000 food boxes. We were able to provide tens of thousands of additional meals to people in need. The power of food can nourish communities and strengthen local economies in times of crisis and beyond. When the COVID-19 pandemic hit the country of Haiti, we got to keep empowering farmers and feeding children an egg a day. And when India was experiencing the worst infection rates in the world, Greater Good Charities helped us to continue the support to the needed with food and groceries. On behalf of the one in six people who don't always know where the next meal is coming from, we are deeply grateful to Greater Good Charities for their tremendous efforts and commitment to ending hunger. With human food insecurity being an issue, obviously pet food insecurity was a significant concern as well. Greater Good had our backs and made sure our pantries were always stocked. With trucks of food and supplies to keep people with their pets. You can see the amount of food that we get. 60,000 pounds, tens of thousands of pounds. 250,000 pounds of pet food and supplies. Beds and crates. Incredible enrichment activities and toys. 25,000 monthly servings of food. One million meals to pets. 2.2 million meals to over 50,000 pets. We've also been able to add more people on to our Meals on Wheels for Pets program. And without that food, there's no question in my mind, countless animals would have gone without. There were multiple clients that had called us to surrender their pet. So many were so happy to hear that that was a resource and that we were going to be able to help them. He is amazing. I can't leave his side very long. Thanks to their grants and donations from Greater Good, we were able to help over 11,000 animals stay in their homes. Pets who need medical care that the families can't completely cover. We've been working with community partners financially with urgent medical care for families' pets. We're so grateful 
our partnership with the Greater Good Charities, allowing us to provide free veterinary care. So pets like Noreen or Cozy were able to get emergency surgery. COVID changed the landscape of animal sheltering. We've had a lot more fosters be able to step up this year. Greater Good connected over 83,000 people with available time and space and an open heart with over 1,400 shelters that raised their hand and said, yes, we want to look for an alternative for our animals in care. Thailand, of course, relies on tourists and the number of animals at the sanctuary has nearly doubled since the Covid outbreak began. Thanks to Greater Good Charities and our supporters, we've been able to ensure that no animal need is turned away. With tourism coming to a screeching halt, it was extraordinarily difficult to find adoptive homes on the islands. We did a massive transfer off the island. It really helped pull us from sort of a precipice. Those pets moved to the mainland, all found loving homes. And to be a part of that was just incredible. In this month, nature took back lands and water. With this support, we were able to continue habitat patrols and community crop guarding activities that build a community consensus for conservation. Thanks to the support from the Greater Good Charities, we managed to ensure effective protection of the Land of the Leopard National Park. Thank you for fundraising and helping us bring the food to almost 2,000 elephants all over around Thailand. I would like to express my gratitude. We're so grateful for Greater Good Charities. Thank you for being such a magnificent leader and a shining example to all. Thank you, Greater Good Charities, for helping us all weather this pandemic. Greater Good always calls. They're there for us. They help us. I can't imagine what would have happened if we didn't have Greater Good Charity support. We are just so grateful to be your partner. Through that partnership, the impact has been profound. Because of Greater Good Charities, we have been able to save more lives. We could not do what we do without Greater Good Charities. So thank you so much. <laughs> thank you from all of us for your support. Thank you so much from the bottom of our hearts. Thank you, Greater Good. Thank, Thank you, you, Greater Good, good Charities. charities. We love, love you, Greater Good. Thank you, Greater Good Charities. Thank you, Greater Good. Thank you, Greater Good Charities. Thank you, Greater Good. So much. I want to thank our partners for making what we do possible. And to all the donors, we say thank you. Thank you so very much. It's people like you that really make the world a better place. Together, we are better. Together, we amplify the good. Woo! <laughs>